add three numbers. Grade one. When we add three numbers, we can change which two add-ins we add first. The sum will always stay the same. Let's try an example. 3 plus 4 plus 2. Take a look at the model. First, let's add 3 plus 4. We get 7. Add 2. 7 plus 2 equals 9. We can change the order of the two sums that we add first. Let's start over by adding two different numbers. 4 plus 2 equals 6. Now add 3. 6 plus 3 equals 9. Let's try a different order. 3 plus 2 equals 5. Now add 4. 5 plus 4 equals 9. As you can see, all the sums are the same. So 3 plus 4 plus 2 equals 9. We can use five different strategies to add three numbers. Count on doubles, doubles plus one, doubles minus one, and make a 10. Let's do some examples. Choose a strategy. Circle two add-ins to add first. Write the sum. Then find the total sum. Then use a different strategy and add again. You can group the add-ins in any order and in different ways to find the sum. Five plus four plus four. We see two of the same numbers, so we use doubles. We circle 4 and 4. Now we add them. 4 plus 4 equals 8. Now add 5 to 8. We get 13. So 5 plus 4 plus 4 equals 13. Now let's solve the same problem, but with a different strategy. Circle 5 and 4. Let's use the doubles plus 1 strategy. We can rewrite 5 as 4 plus 1. Then we add 4. 4 and 4 are doubles. We know that 4 plus 4 equals 8. We add 1 and we get 9. Now add 4 to 9 to get 13. So 5 plus 4 plus 4 equals 13. We solved this problem using two different strategies, but the result was the same. Let's try another one. 5 plus 6 plus 4. Circle 5 and 6. We can use the doubles minus 1 strategy. Rewrite 5 as 6 minus 1. Then add 6. 6 and 6 are doubles. We know that 6 plus 6 equals 12. 12 minus 1 equals 11. Then add 4 to 11 to get 15. 5 plus 6 plus 4 equals 15. Let's do the same problem using a different strategy. Circle 6 and 4. This time, use the make a 10 strategy. We add 6 plus 4 to make 10. Then we add 5 to 10 to get 15. So 5 plus 6 plus 4 equals 15. Once again, we used different strategies, but the sum stayed the same. Let's try another example. 3 plus 1 plus 3. Circle 3 and 3. We're going to use the doubles method. 3 and 3 are doubles, and we know that 3 plus 3 equals 6. Next, we add 1 to 6 to get 7. So 3 plus 1 plus 3 equals 7. Let's do the same problem using a different strategy. Circle 3 and 1. Let's use the count on strategy. 3 plus 1 equals 4. Now add 3 to 4 to get 7. 3 plus 1 plus 3 equals 7. Let's try another one. 3 plus 2 plus 7. Circle 3 and 7. We're going to use the make a 10 strategy to solve. 3 plus 7 equals 10. Now add 2 to 10 to get 12. 3 plus 2 plus 7 equals 12. 
Let's do the same problem using a different strategy. Circle 3 and 2. Use the count on strategy to solve. 3 plus 2 equals 5. Add 7 to 5 to get 12. So 3 plus 2 plus 7 equals 12. If you thought this video was helpful, please leave a like. For more videos like this, please subscribe.